Yeah, this is uh, this is the new setup that uh, Trigger X and VMC came up with this year. It's called the Drop Dead Minnow, and VMC come up with this Drop Dead Minnow hook. And this hook is specially designed for this bait, and it really gives it an erratic action, both back and forth, just like regular other fluke style baits. But the really neat thing about the way this weight is positioned is when you stop it, that bait will quiver and it'll almost swim back away from you. And this is really, I believe, going to be a real big killer, especially in the early sp spring around the time of the spawn. But it's a great bait whenever you're fishing in the summertime, especially whenever you're like on the blueback herring lakes where you got to fish a bait real fast. And we're going to try to throw this around some of this shallow cover and see if we can't get a few bass to bite it here in the summer. Of course, you, I'm kind of varying my retrieve. You know, you can fish it fast where the bait skips just like this, you know, and cause a lot of commotion. You know, and probably guys out in Georgia and the Carolinas and the blueback herring lakes, that's really a good way to fish it. But, you know, I'm kind of varying it. Sometimes I'll throw it up there and I'll kind of speed it up. Then when I get to the target, I'll just let the bait sink or settle. And then I'll kind of slowly twitch the bait back and the bait w really walks real well back and forth. So. I'm kind of trying some different retrieves to see if I can kind of hit on the way the bass want the bait today. And I can walk the bait just like that where the bait cuts back and forth. I can skip the bait out of the water. You know, I can stop the bait to where it flutters around the cover. You know, I just try to make it look real erratic and try not to do always do the same thing twice. Try to make the bait, you know, look, make it look injured like an injured shad. You know, they make this drop dead minnow hook in various sizes. I think I've got an eighth ounce on here, but they make it in a 16th, 332nd. So you've kind of got a lot of different options as to how fast you want your sink rate or, you know, just kind of vary it to whatever, whatever your liking might be. See if I can get one to come up on top. There's lots, I know there's lots of little minnows right up on the surface back in this little pocket. Let's see if I can get a hold of him here. I may not be able to catch him. Ah, got one on the drop dead minnow. Not a bad fish. That's one thing. This is a pretty unique little weight system. Kind of the way the weight is on the bottom of the, the hook. It's something you need to really look into. Like I said, you can fish it a lot of different ways. You can twitch it, you can skip it up on top of the water. And like I said, you can stop it next to cover and it'll cause it to dart and dive and it really gives it a lot of action as the bait so it as the bait sinks. So look for the drop dead minnow and the VMC drop dead minnow hook at your local tackle stores. Throw out there and see if I can catch another one. 